Hi guys, welcome back to Mars Game Pass River by Susan Hira YouTube channel. Now, today we are going to discuss top tips and tricks for English checkpoint. The code 0861 is for checkpoint lower secondary best strategy for the exam. Point number one is time management. So total duration for the paper is usually 1 hour 10 minutes, so we manage our time. We spend 30 minutes for section A, that is around 12 to 13 question is reading comprehension and 30 minutes for section B is writing and 5 minutes for skimming throughout the text and 5 minutes to check our answers so that's the time management next point number 2 skim at the question first and keep in mind the keywords or the points being asked so when you read the text you can locate the answer really quickly here is the example so this is an example of a paper so question 1 Let's just make a quick look at all the questions. Papa, Mama, Carlos, Esperanza. So keep in mind, uh, narrators, who is the narrator of the story. Next is Family's Hope. Seems likely to come through. Next, quotation. And then next, number three is look at the first, second. What are the differences between houses described in each paragraph? So. Why has the writer put this paragraph next to each other? Next is good at the phrase, you know, so small, you would think they were holding their breath, line 10. What technique is this an example of? All right, number five, one quotation that tells the reader the loomies is a dangerous area. There, there is repeated four times in Italy. What does the, tell the reader so? And the confusion, amusement, contempt. 6B, the nurses am embarrassed about the house, give one quotation. Question 7, look at this sentence, but I know how those things go. What does the nurse mean in the sentence above? Question 8, look at lines 33 to 38, give one example of each of the following. Metaphor, repetition, illustration. So keep in mind this one. What does the reader learn about mother's character? Question 9, look at the section of the text under the heading my name. So give two reasons. Question 10 lines 50, 45 to 51. Quotation Wild horse of a woman, so while she wouldn't marry, my great grandfather threw a sack over her head and carried her off. She looked out the window her whole life. Or what it tells the reader. Now, question 11 What genre is the story? Is the stack historical science? Comical realized. Question 12 Look at the old text explained for where the Esperanza wants her life to be different in the future. So we have take a quick look of all the questions. Now let's uh, after that, the next step to you is to read scheme the text for five minutes. So you can have five minutes to read all this. So that's how it works. So next point, we move to point number three and four. Point number three is the question from number one till the end, follow the order from top to bottom paragraph. Meaning, question one, uh, we'll find the answer from the whole text, and question two, uh, from lines one till eight. So it is line one till eight. Question three, we'll find from line one till 15. And then question four, we'll find the answer in lines 10. Question 5, we find the answer from lines 16 till 20, so it's in order of getting uh, down to the bottom. Next is question 6, is line 21 till 24, it's the next line after that, continue. In line 24, and then after that will be question 7, 26 till 27, so continue from uh, the paragraph before, 26, 27. And question 8 will be after that, 33 to 38. 33 to 38. So, and then now question 9 is 39, 39 till 53. So it's getting to the bottom, to the end. And then question 10 is 45 till 51. So it's according to the order from beginning till the end. Uh, the question, we move from question 1, 2, 3, and so on. So that is the meaning of that. So it's easy for us to locate the answer as it's just getting. Uh, to the end, to the bottom. Right. Point number four is read the instruction carefully. 
tick the box questions. There are some. So this is specific type of question. Tick the box question. So check if you have to tick one box or two boxes. So what is the key message? Ticks one box. And this is one box. So keep in mind you have to choose only one box. So here's the example of tick one box question. Now there is also possibility that you will be asked. Look at this sentence. When the sun does come out, it does so apologetically, like a ballerina who is unsure of her entrance on stage. Line 11 to 12. So, what literary techniques does the writer use in the sentence about two boxes? Now, you have to keep in mind that you have to choose two boxes for this one. So, see the difference? One box, take one box, and this is two box. So, read instruction carefully. Next, there's question which asks which two words, which phrase, Give one word question, question uh, give a quotation question. So, what is the meaning of this? So, in a test, you might find question which say which two words question. So, this example, the writer does not necessarily agree with all the information in the first paragraph. Which two words or phrases tell the reader this? So, the answer for this, you can write down only two words or phrases. It means it can be one or few words. So just two words, it will be great, or two phrases. All right. So here we go. This is an, an example of correct answer for which two words or phrases that tell the reader they. So we say often consider so called this they. It's both are two words. All right. We hope it's clear for the question which which of which two words questions. Next, we move on to give one word question. Here's an example of give one word question. Give one word that tells the reader that Prox is surprised. So that these sentences, but these were not words. Prox listened drums, struck to the sounds falling from envelopes, drooping mouth. So one word, it means we just have to write one word, not more than that. That's the tips. And the answer itself, you can find from this sentence because the sentence are, is given. So this, the sentences are given. Uh, but these were not word props, this and dumb struck to the sounds falling from arrows drooping mouth. So one word that tells me that Prox is surprised. So from here we skim the word that surprise is dumb struck. One word. This is one word question. Next. Now we see the which phrase, which phrase question. So we go, this is the example of give one phrase question. Okay, the first line, line 1 till 9, give one phrase that shows that Petra's guests did not mix together socially. From here, so we have to answer one phrase. One phrase can consist of one to few words, so uh, you can fill in the answer. The example of correct answer for this one is, I will be given 10 seconds from now. Find your answer, so... Okay, let's check the answer. So these are the examples, and, and mo mostly we keep ourselves to ourselves. So one phrase that shows Petra's guests do not mix socially. Right, uh, that is one phrase question. Next, next is give a quotation question. Let's check. So this is the example of give a quotation question. So. Explain the, what the writer's opinion of the Tour de France is. Give a quotation from the text to support your answer. So, we have to quote from the text. Uh, try to find, read this one and find the answer. So, the correct answer for this one will be revealed after 10 seconds. Try to skim the text. Alright, so let's open up the answer. So the writer thinks that the Tour de France is the highlight of the season. Quotation will be the Tour de France, the climax of the bike racing season. So quotation question means quote from the text. 
Tour de France, the climax of the bike racing season. Writer thinks that the, the Tour de France is the highlight of the season. Right? So that's the tip for today. So again, we repeat from the beginning. The first tip is time management. Manage your times wisely. Second, second tip is skim the question before you start everything. And keep in mind the keywords and after that you read the text. Tips number three is find your answer in order from top to bottom. Tips number four is read instruction carefully. Check the type of question. Is it tick the box? How many boxes should we tick? One box or is it two boxes? Or uh, which type of question? Is it which two words? Which phrase question? Give one word question or give a quotation question. Check your question carefully. Which two words? And then it will be give one word question and one phrase question and also you have a, a quotation from text with different type of question see it carefully and good luck for your test so here's the address for this channel youtube.com slash at marskin and you go to our home page uh, this is our home page. You can see many videos here and also check the playlist as you find many solings that might be helpful to you. Bye-bye. Uh, so don't forget to check this part and here to subscri uh, subscribe to this channel as it will motivate us to make more videos like this and Please give thumbs up if this is helping and share to as many friends as possible. I'll see you in the next tips. Bye bye for now. We hope today's tips will be useful for you and to build your confidence for the exam. Bye bye and see you. God bless you.